<laughs> I'm going to talk to you today about body language. And um, first, let's just um, talk a little bit about how body language, <laughs> our nonverbal behaviors really, really influence the inferences that other people make about us. So people mostly, from our nonverbal behaviors, are inferring things like, how strong is this person? How trustworthy is this person? How competent is this person? Um, how much do I like this person? And these inferences are responsible for really important outcomes. And we make them quickly, sometimes in a split second. And inferences from nonverbal behaviors like how smart do I think this person is? They predict things like election outcomes. They predict who gets hired, who gets promoted, who gets asked out on a date. So all kinds of outcomes are determined by nonverbal behaviors, and that process happens pretty quickly. But I'm going to focus today um, on specific nonverbal behaviors. And before I do that, I want to ask you right now to think about what are you doing with your bodies. So how many of you have your arms crossed or your legs crossed or even your ankles crossed? Um, how many of you are making yourself smaller so that you don't bump into the person next to you? How many people are sprawled out and actually have their arm draped on the chair next to them? Or their knees spread? So I want you to pay attention to that. And I think, I hope that in 10 minutes I'm going to convince you that if you tweak your nonverbal behaviors in really pretty easy and simple ways for a short period of time, it's going to make you feel more powerful through physiological changes in your body.